I'm gonna fucking kill you! <laughs> you're not in a position to kill anyone, my way, white and brew friend. You, you're the bastard that's been selling weapons to terrorists around the world. Do you see all the chaos you've caused? Yes, I did help all the terrorists of the world by arming them, but that's because I need chaos. Why? So I can become Supreme World Reader, of course. You see, tonight I will be doing a worldwide television broadcast, an infomercial in which I will act as if I'm the solution to the world's problems. Ha! The people of America will never accept you as their leader. You're not that good of an actor. I know. That's why I got help. Send them in! The Film Actors Guild? What are you doing here? I never thought I'd live to see the day when you war-hungry, flag-waving bastards got what was coming to you. This is great! The Film Actors Guild has agreed to give a speech tonight and endorse me as world reader. What? That's right. Mr. Ill has a plan to make a united world with no borders. A share land, he calls it, where everyone just gets along without violence. That's right, share land. And he's going to give control of America to us, the actors, so finally we can run things the way we want. <laughs> you idiots. He's going to use you to take over the world, and then he's going to kill you. Still spewing your hate. This is a new era. Your gun-toting Team America is gone, and soon all American politics will be decided by actors. Oh, dear Jesus. All right, come on, my fine actor friends. We must prepare for the worldwide broadcast. Oh, and bring the girl up to my bedroom. No, no, the pretty girl. Bitch. Yeah, sure, just take the hot girl. Don't take the girl that really has something to offer. My God, the actors are going to convince the world to let Kim Jong-il take over. Somebody has to stop this. <laughs> 